from Archibald Blair Elementary School spent the afternoon with the City of Richmond's environment staff to learn about some of the species living within the Terra Nova Rural Park and to discover how Richmond is providing habitat so they can survive and thrive. is 63 acres of natural habitat and it's extremely important because it is adjacent to the Pacific Flyway. The city protects large swaths of bird habitat and has installed owl boxes and other bird houses for black-capped chickadees and tree swallows. walking past the water, take a look to see if you can catch any tree swallows taking a little bath and catching an insect at the same time. The City of Richmond became the first certified bat-friendly community in Greater Vancouver. of female bats nesting, roosting in the bat condo between April and September. Do, do bats actually allergic to the sun? They're not allergic to the sun, but they much prefer to come out at night when it's cooler and quieter. So at night, they're gonna come out and they're going to fly through the air catching insects. And that's the reason why we love bats, is because they control the mosquito populations. Bats are natural pest controllers and save farmers billions of dollars each year. Did you know that pregnant females will consume their body weight in insects? They will eat over a thousand bugs every night. The city installed a bat condo at Terra Nova, which was specially built to house up to 3,000 of the nocturnal insect eaters. Did you know that they're the only flying mammal? Yeah. Yeah, you knew that? Of course, because you're very knowledgeable about bats, which is great because they are important in our ecosystem and we want to protect them as much as possible. This is amazing. I just reached out to see if there would be any interest in somebody talking to us about pollinators in Richmond, about rewilding. Um, because we planted an indigenous healing garden at our school, we were learning about indigenous plants. So the fact that the city has kind of come out in uh, droves to help us has been absolutely amazing. So the riparian habitat is their favorite place to be. Does anybody know how many species of bees there are? The city of Richmond planted the Terra Nova pollinator meadow, rich with pollinating plants, and at its center is an apiary, which is where many different kinds of bees can live. The bees really like our province, so there are an estimated 500 bee species in British Columbia. Plant yes! We need the bees to help the plants because they pollinate the plants and they create food for us. They're fun to see bumbling about and you might even see some living in here. Richmond staff make it a priority to connect with schools because we know students are the future decision makers. When we engage kids at a young age, we can teach them about the value of the natural environment, the vulnerability of our indigenous species, and how important it is to protect their local habitat. 